Here you are. No, it's all on. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so good at this. Wait, we're live. Uh, what? <laughs> this is the box. We're doing a first impression of the Mystical Cat's Tarot. This is my deck, not Dustin's. Um, Llewellyn and the art is by Mickey Mueller and the book is by Lunea Weatherstone maybe? Uh, the book's kind of neat. They actually have it's cat advice not keywords which is interesting. I haven't read the book I just flipped through but there's some interesting artwork in here that's not in the actual deck itself which is kind of cool. Um, just kind of scattered around of course, oh yeah, I like this one. This one I thought was really cute. I like that. All right. Do I need to put it like right there, maybe? Oh, you can. <laughs> there, yeah. All right. So this is the deck. I'm gonna open them up here. Oh my God, I feel like those people that I watched it. <laughs> you are so you ill prepared. Have it. You still have it in the <laughs> So about right there. Yep, you can do that. Or oh yeah, the bags. Back. Okay, yeah. So let me leave that there and I'll zoom it in. So we know where. You're just gonna cut that out, right? Yeah. Sure. He's like, not really. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> whatever you say, Gina. It's what? It's like whatever you say. Call me Gina. <laughs> <laughs> cardstock. Yeah, so well in cardstock. It's already a little warped. <laughs> I just opened it, so yeah, the well in cardstock. Um, that's the first one. Where is the can? Okay, the can is like. What's it doing? So are, are you guys readers of that? Or mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yeah, we actually use them. Read it. We're readers. Oh. Did you want a reading? No, I, just, I told him that I thought you all were readers. Mm -hmm. Ask him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I had that. <laughs> <laughs> Throw me under the bus. No, uh, I just figured you were a reader. Yeah, yeah. we are. Well, you know, why did you ask me to ask? <laughs> <laughs> thought, I thought you thought. Okay, so this is the fool. That's kind of cute. What do you think of that? <laughs> Makes me think of a cat. <laughs> I'm just you don't own cat. cats, do you? Because cats I have a person. Mm. Well, no, he I'm talking about him. Yeah. What do you think of that for the fool? Um, may I? Yeah, thank you. It's it's the curious. Yeah, yeah. The curiosity. Yeah. Um, I think killed the cat. I think it could stand to show. It's very, uh, it's a very cute card. I like yeah. it, but I think it could stand to show a little bit more of the um, the, the negative side of yeah. the card. Yeah, because right now it looks kind of fanciful and um, yeah, not quite so scary. Yeah. That's this true. Adorable you know, if they had put maybe some clouds Sorry. in it. Okay. Oh god, she get the hammer. <laughs> Sorry. If, oh, that's yeah. smart. If they put some clouds in there, that may have addressed some of that. I don't know. And I'm going to just put these on top of each other so I know where to put them. What do you think of the high priestess? Or no, this is the magician. Am I putting the cards wrong? <laughs> <laughs> you did that yourself. We're going to start all over, aren't we? Start with the pool. Alright. Alright, so this one is the pool. We've already discussed this a little bit. But we kind of think that it could, you know, give a nod to the, um, the negative aspects of this card, which is the, you know, something might happen nefariously in the background or something. I don't know. Some clouds. It's, it's cute though. I like it. I don't think this is a beginner's deck anyway. Right? No. no so, still and you have to, I think you really have to have owned cats or they don't, aren't really owned. Um, had a cat in your house. Oh, so they own you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, because they don't really <clears throat> Oh, I dropped this. Yeah, I really suck at this, Dustin. <laughs> <laughs> I really do. <laughs> oh my god, is that snort a blooper? <coughs> Alright, so the magician. Yeah, there's a lot. 
I like the magician. I think it works like any other flat magician card, you know, where they've got their tools and they're doing it's stuff. It's a kitty with powers. Mm -hmm. I do like the um, the kind of He's witchy kind of looking. Yeah. <laughs> He's like. Arr. He's like, you are no longer in the bowl. You are now under my control. <laughs> exactly. It's like he's done some, yeah, like he's got his, his little, like little pentagram. And I, I do like the herbs hanging down and stuff like that. Yeah. It's it gives fun. kind of a, a witchy feel to it. This is my favorite card, but I, I haven't seen this whole deck. I've seen the no. Major Arcana, and I've seen the... Um, a couple of the minors, but I haven't seen the court cards. I really like that one. That's actually the, the card that made me think, oh, I might get that deck because that looks like a high priestess card to me. Right? Mm -hmm. I mean, that really conveys that feeling. She's beautiful, too. Beautiful little kitty cat. And I think this one works for the Empress. I think Shanda would really like that. The oh, kitten yeah. is, you know. I like how they have like little jewels. Mm -hmm to kind of signify and they change I think through the deck right mm -hmm. where they're at and what kind of jewels they are which might be it might be in the book I don't know you know might you know because some books will take that and then ex you know expand upon that and this is the emperor which I really like he looks like he's in charge so that works for me <laughs> it's like it's gonna attack is it is this in the right spot like is it are they fitting in yeah. there? Okay. Mm, if you want to line it up with this right here. Right here? Yeah. Oh, I see, like right there. Mm, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I really like that. The throne helps, I think, with that. And the pillar. I really like this one, too. Ooh. Yeah. This is the um, Hierophant, but he's a priest, which really looks work, works really well here, this Egyptian theme. Uh, I really, it's beautiful, I think. Yeah, I like the Egyptian mm -hmm. the the motif on there. This is the lovers. I think that works really well too. And it also, because <laughs> the cat is she like pulling him towards her? Or <laughs> is she pushing back. out of the crowd? Right. Well, and also cats will cuddle. Um, what I like about this the most is that cats will cuddle with the same sex, not in mm -hmm. a romantic way, right? And the lovers card does translate that well too. Mm -hmm. You know, that way as well. So I do like that. Yeah. This one, not so much. I don't like this card as much. Because it's like these doll, these um, wow. Dalmatians look like they've got this goofy grin on their face, right? It just, mm. I don't like this. I think they could have done It's like, hey, we're going to get a treat when we're done. We're going to get a treat when we're done. Exactly. This makes like, looks like yeah. the dogs are stupid. Cats rule, dogs yeah, exactly. rule. Exactly. <laughs> I think it went a little too far with the comic part, maybe, or maybe the goofiness of it. I, oh, those are yeah. great Danes. Those aren't even Dalmatians. Oh, they're not? No, those are great Danes. Oh, well, I don't know when dogs well enough, but yeah, I just, I, I think they could have done this card in a totally different direction, so, uh, and it works. I mean, it, yeah. it works for the card, but I, I don't it's particularly cute. care for it. It's cutesy. I really like that card. I think that works real well. Mm -hmm. And the opposite direction, right? Because it's not a cat. It's, you know, it's, it's the birdies. The cat has the string not to eat the bird. <laughs> well, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's good. That's good. Yeah, that or it's a trap. <laughs> One of the two. We will get you. Like, how do they on me? But he's I'll cute. You, and then I'll eat you for dinner. <laughs> you can get And let's see. This one is the hermit. It's okay. I mean, it's... If I was a cat and I was a hermit, that's where I'd be. That's a pomegranate tree. Yeah. Would you think they would have put in the High Priestess? Because that's usually where I see it, yeah. but it's okay. It's even got the crescent moon. Mm -hmm. Well, there's no light, which kind of, I kind of like the hermit to have the light, but it's okay. I mean, it's it's readable. Well, it's up in a tree look at it. There's only one pomegranate that's cut open. Open. So oh, that's probably well, that, a resemblance of the light. Yeah, probably. Oh, that's smart. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad I'm doing this with you because I may not have picked up on that myself. I do like this card. I like the um, the wheel. I think that's that's cute. Please let him. I see that started again. <laughs> that looks like one of those uh, Chinese mm -hmm. fireworks. Yeah. Yeah, and it's even got the little. It's a Chinese symbol, I think, maybe in the middle. That's the uh, ohm. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Symbol for ohm, wherever that came from. Yeah. I think it's pretty, though. 
And I think it works for the wheel. Yeah, it's simplistic. Yeah. And I like that one too. Consequences, which would be what? Um, um, judgment? Yeah, is this 11? Yeah. So this would be um, the or justice card, right? Yeah. And so it's justice. And that works for me. It, it would take a little minute. I think I'd have to set with it a little bit, but yeah, it works. And I, he it's must have. Strange. Well, but he's he's um he he's bird. tangled and he's got a bird and yeah. Oh had a bird. <laughs> yeah. Well, I really like the detail that they put on these cards, like the backgrounds of these. Mm, yeah. Somebody else was complaining about it because they said there was just too much going on, but I actually really like that. I think they did a really nice job on the well, artistic part of it. They think there's so much it. going on. They need to look at the, the uh, Paulina or something. Paulina, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and this is the hanging, uh, the hangman, which is the floating, the floating cat. cat, which is a little weird, but I mean it works. And I do. Sorry, could you stop? <laughs> <laughs> I do like the the what are those blue bells? Is it lined up now? Thank goodness you didn't get a copy. Oh God. No. Uh, miracle. Uh, no. Morning glories. Is it morning? Oh, that's right. <clears throat> We used to have those in a place we used to live at. What's the significant there? Do you know? Don't they open up in the morning and close yeah, at night? Yeah, they only open in the morning usually. Yeah. Maybe that has something to do with it. Uh, I'll be interested to see this book to kind of, you know. It could be get four o'clock too, but. Which are only evening ones, right? They, they open at yeah. four. It's supposed to. Everywhere. <laughs> no matter what time zone. Work clock, guys. I don't know. Yeah, this is a death I card. I do like that one, actually. I do, too. Yeah, I do, too. Because it speaks to that nine oh, look, lives I was going to say, all of its lives are back there. Yeah. But it also, you know, the rebirth, mm. the, the transformation comes through in this card. And mm. and the death, you know. The, so I, I do like that. And it's a pretty card, too. It's been, The execution, I think, on this deck is, is nice. Yeah, I, I like it. <laughs> Used, used execution on the death card. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was kind of bad, wasn't it? Uh, the temperance card works for me. I like that. I like the water. The balance, you know, trying oh. to get across. It also kind of gives me a Moses feel, too. Oh. Like, right. <laughs> I'm parting the sea with my cat eyes. It's kind of weird, but... You know. I like the... What is that like in the background, though? So, like a coastal a tree thing? or a... uh, I think it well, maybe it is but it, I think it's kind of like a building back there maybe oh. Let's that. Mm, I'm not sure doesn't that look like a building because it would be far away so yeah and that's what it looks yeah. like it looks like a structure in a oh look it's my cat I don't like this card. Mm. I don't like this card. Um, this is the double card, Demon Cat. And mainly because it doesn't show the you can get away concept of the devil card to me. You know, like you're doing this to yourself. But it, it kind of does with, like, he's kind of trapped himself in that, whatever that thorn thing is. Briar patch. I just don't like it. I mean, I'm going to use it, but... I was wearing socks. I wasn't gonna kick him out, but I also wasn't gonna tell him to go. He can't come in. No. <laughs> it's also kind of hot in here. I can't really blame him for wanting to sit in the car. So, are you leaving or can you? I don't know. Uh, you know, I, it looks like a Halloween card, too, to me. That may be one of the reasons why I don't like it. Because I want a Halloween stuff to be in a Halloween stuff. Not everywhere, but. What do you think of the card? Well, I mean, he's not like the obvious that the bird's not dead. No, he's still alive, I think. Or his head would be down, right? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I could see it working. It's just uh... Just a different kind of way. Mm -hmm. Now, this card... <laughs> definitely a cat owner's thing. Like, that's those towers that you can get on, you know? Yes. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, but there's a lot of, like crap going on in the background, right? Like a storm and lightning. So it definitely conveys that. And it's a very beautiful tower too, right? It's pretty. It's got filigree on it. 
and they're falling off. I mean, it's definitely, I mean, it's a tower card. They've been repousing too much. <laughs> yes. <laughs> now that one up top is really, like, he's distraught. But look at that orange cat. I don't know. What do you think? That's a good, that, I like the way that that one's mm -hmm. done. At least it's not like lightning striking the cat. Yeah, yeah, I don't <laughs> think I would like that too much. That would be a little bit too much. This one's the one that's on the box, um, which is stars. It's okay, I like it. I mean, it's pretty. It seems like a very ethereal cat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And why is he, oh, he's looking at a lion. He's looking at Leo. At first I thought that was a stallion. <laughs> I was like, why is he looking at a horse? If you would look at it, Stephanie. I bet you these flower or these this growth is significant. I don't know. That is a, a maiden hair tree. Wow. How do you know all this stuff? So is that significant? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> That's my, Ooh, I like this card. That's my answer for everything, probably. Probably, maybe. I like this card. This is another card that Either I thought that I would. It's one of the two. It looks familiar, but... Not ginseng. Um, ginkgo. Ginkgo? It's either maiden hair or ginkgo. Mm -hmm. Well, because they both have same leaves. It's pretty. <laughs> I'm here to decipher the flowers. <laughs> exactly. I love this moon card. That is pretty. Isn't that pretty? It's a pretty moon card. And look, you've still got the pillars. They're just the mushrooms. Mm -hmm. All the trees in the background too. Yeah, that too. Or maybe these are the wolves, or maybe. But there's a. Is it a death head moth or? I'm not sure what kind of mom. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I like this card. It was it's one of the It's gonna rain. Was... Look, it's gonna yeah. rain around the way. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna rain. He's pretty. And I like how he's kind of looking. Well, it looks like a he or. Well, maybe it's just maybe she too, but. He kind of looks it like it's looking at me. you, you know, kind of like beseeching you, you know. I like that. Come explore at your own risk. Oh yeah, it's a sun card. There's another Egyptian theme card. That works for me. I like that sundial. Mm -hmm. yeah. I figured there'd probably be quite a, bit, a lot of Egyptian stuff on this because mm -hmm. that's the sacred animal yeah. or the protector. Ooh, I like this next card too. I'm cheating. <laughs> um, I like the good kitty, which is judgment. We used to have a cat that was very similar to that cat. Okay. <laughs> like Peter Pan cat. Yeah. It like to me. Exactly. Think good thoughts, positive thoughts, believe. <laughs> Wait, she looked. She put little eyelashes on it, or I guess is it a Mickey is kind of a androgynous name. I don't know if that's a boy or a girl. And then the world card, and then we're gonna get into cards I haven't seen before. So the world card, it works. It just. Not that all exciting for a world card to me. Well, <clears throat> no, it's not exciting, but it it does work very well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does. Because either there's not a glass there and it can go out into the world, mm -hmm. or you're going to get set where it's of, at. Now. Yeah, or you get the sense that there is a glass there and it can't go. Right. Yeah. Depending, depending on how you. Right. I wonder what this one looks like. Ooh. Kind of like this shape. I didn't realize the curve that was in it until you turned mm -hmm. it upside down. The curvature of the world. Oh yeah, that's what I. That was one of the first things I noticed was that because it made it feel very expansive. Mm -hmm. right? And the sun sparkle thing. That I'm sure that that you know that works. I like that. Yeah. And kitties like to look out the window. They do that a lot. All right. So this is the fire suit, which I'm going to assume is the wands. Mm -hmm. Cause that's normally how that. Yeah. I do kind of like that one. Yeah. It looks kind of. I don't know that. It's flames. The question is: Is is the cat inside there or outside? <laughs> Ooh. Mm. Wow, there's a lot of flames going on there. That looks really pretty though. I like that. 
filigree yeah. gate looking thing. It's luring you in. Yeah, it's like, are you on, which side of the gate are you on kind of thing. I like that. I like that a lot. Two of wands. That works. Yeah. Yep, that works. I like the detail on the doors. I'm going to try to go quicker through these. Um, oh, yeah, I like this because it's got that expectant look like something's mm -hmm. coming, right? Three of Wands is one of my favorite cards for the miners. Oh, I yeah. use it in a lot of small work. Go back to that one, though. Oh. Like, this is, I, I'm going to, like, critique it now. Oh, fine. Look at the freaking elbow where it's at. The what? The elbow. Oh, you know what? They didn't do that right, did they? Uh, it's like... It should have been like this, right? Or yeah. like... Yeah, that looks like the... The bot... Oh, great. Now every time I see this card, I'm going to think that. Yeah, it doesn't <laughs> look like that was drawn quite right. Hmm. Um, four... Oh, party? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, do Where's they the really party head? in disco lights? I'm not sure. <laughs> Hot, you know, I don't like this card. I would have preferred them been in like a field with, you know, a bouquet of flowers Well, or looking something. at this way though, there's light coming in and it's hitting a prismatic sphere. Right. And so it's casting all these rainbows and you know, cats like mm -hmm. to chase oh. the lights. Kind of like that little laser light we got for our cat. Okay. <laughs> All right, I like the I got a bit pretty cat. Thank you, Dustin. It's like now oh. she understands. This works. <clears throat> that works for the five. Oh yeah. They are not happy. They're trying. Are they trying to get something? Is this a competition? Or is it just a conflict? It looks like it's just a conflict. Maybe. It almost looks like they're playing versus fighting. Well, sometimes that will come, you know, they will mm -hmm. hone in on that instead. Six of fire. Oh, wow. He's triumphant. They brought him little, oh, yeah, they brought him little toys, right? A little. Like, come on, be our yeah. friend. Come on, play, play. Well, see, this is the triumph card, right? This is, you know, mm -hmm. I've won. I'm the king cat, right? Interesting, they're paying tribute. <laughs> I like that, actually. Uh, seven of Swords. Oh, he's, he's got his back up and he's... Seven of Fire. Yeah, yeah that works good. Or, yeah, what did I say? Seven. Swords. Oh. <laughs> seven of Wands, but Fire. Is that how they sell card, though? Uh, oh, this one works. Eight of, eight of Wands. There's some movement going on there. He's going so fast, he's kicked up the rug, right? He's that moving, works. but not very far forward. No. It's like that cartoon. Mm. You know, where there's... Nine of Fire. Oh, this is very similar to my Silver Witch craft. They're all staying around a campfire. Huh? Yeah, that works for me very well, since I've, I already have that concept in another deck. So, yeah. I really love the detail that they put on the mm -hmm. columns and the sky and stuff. Because, I mean, they could have just put a blank sky back there, right? There's a lot of detail in so the back. You when I have a house that has a room like that where Lower, it's just right, open. Right. Um, they used to do that quite a bit when they, you know, back in the day when they used them for, um, what do you call it? Um, oh, they have a specific name, but they used them for towers, astronomy towers, mm -hmm. basically what they are. Ten of Fire, that works. Somebody's getting really jacked up there. They too much going on. They're... Well, the fire is shooting out at everything. He looks worried. <laughs> what is going on? Okay, so the core cards are Kitten, Tom, Queen, and Keen. I just haven't seen them. Oh, Holy sir, I don't work for a living. That's cute. <laughs> Oh, he got his tail burnt. Oh, wow. Oh. That kind of works, though, right? Mm -hmm. The page is not experienced enough with fire, and it burned its tail. Like, here, let me play this. Okay, that did not feel so good. <laughs> yeah, but he's still, you know, he's still exploring it, right? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, that works very well, actually. That's probably one of the best page of wands I've ever seen. All right, this is the night. Yeah, come on. Oh, that's interesting concept. Where you have to like maneuver your way through the candles. 
What do you think of that one? Well, that's kind of a, like, well, you see the other one where it got burned. You know, right. Experience. But here he's experiencing that one yeah. goes through it. Okay. Wow, that's smart. Well, I, I like that. I like it when people look at the concept and take it into a way that. And now they go, know? like, advance it from that to. Yeah, the, this one's actually very pretty. She's. <laughs> I love that Persian field of cat, you know? We used to have a Persian cat, and they they are kind of regal. They even treat themselves that way. Like they expect to be treated that way. And I, I can kind of see that in the, you know, she's got this, she's the queen. They're, they're celebrating her aspect there, aren't they? Oh, that That's one pretty. firework makes it look like a crown. Yeah, it does. And look, you've got the sunflower and the whatever she's setting on. Those are sunflowers. That, that works really well. Oh, she had a mini black cat next to her. Uh, Should have had a little black mouse next right. to her. Yeah. I always like it. I hate it when I see a... I'm so used to it now, but I just don't like it if there's not a black cat in there. Wow, this is... Ooh. Oh, this is even got the salamander. Uh, yeah. Right away. He looks very keenly too. I don't know what kind of cat that is. Do you? Mm -mm. God, he's gorgeous. What is called a feather cat? Yeah, he's got a huge. Oh wow. What's the flower around there? Do you know? Uh, those are little peonies. I bet you that's significant. And that looks like Heather. Is that, <laughs> like that? Is that significant? Probably. Probably. See you, Cass. That, that Heather. That looks like Heather, yeah. I like the fact that he's got like this um, fire thing behind him. And just, mm -hmm. It's very nice. Okay, now we're into the cups, which is the C. That's pretty. So on these, what you can do, go through them, find the ones that you like. Okay, just go quickly. And then the ones that you don't like, you don't, like, that you don't uh, resonate with. I like that one. That one works. That's the Five of Cups. Oh, wow, well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, where's the cat? And I'm like, oh. Uh, I don't quite get this one. This isn't a quick read for me, well, so let's put that go, one. Like, oh, okay. What's that one mean to you? That's the Eight of Cups. Uh, that's not a quick read for me, so... Well, the Eight of Cups, that's the... The Two of Cups is works, I think. Two little lover cats. Oh, I can kind of see where this is going, because it's like a little... It's got its, it's, got its ear up to the conch shell. Yeah. And listening. Yeah, but this is about moving forward, right? Moving on from that. Hmm. You'll have it just to doesn't read for me very well. Uh, yeah, I have to look at what they're saying. So that's one. I think that one works pretty good. Three of Cups. No, I'll see you. Yeah. Four of Cups works. You know, he's kind of despondent there. We've already seen the five. Oh, have you seen the blue lobsters? Mm -hmm. Have you have you seen the blue lobsters? She did say that back. Like they catch them like. Oh, so there are things. So yeah. yeah. Oh, look at this nine of cups. That's interesting. Well, that works. Yeah. Overindulging. Yeah. It's like all the crappy ones. Ah, oh, the ten of cups works real well. Talk about a family. <laughs> look at the look at he's cute. I like him. Oh, that is cute. And then I'm gonna show the queen. Is he walking on water? Is that? Oh, I don't think so. I think he's coming in from well. Because he's not wet. Oh, he's ma He's trying to learn how to master the water. I think this works really well. Oh yeah. Love the detail on the. Oh, look at the sea king. Oh, that looks like a perfect king of cups. Oh, my God. Oh, that's one of those, uh... I think that's a cat's name. Um, I don't know. I'm not very good with those. I can name the flowers, but I... 
the sky is the sword suit, and that's the two of swords. I like that one. Yeah. Oh, this one works really well, even though it's kind of sad. It's the five of swords, and they've got that kitten out there, that or that that Egyptian cat you like. That's oh, the yeah, he looks hungry. Even though they kind of look that way anyway. Usually. <laughs> But that one works, I think. It's like they're... They don't want him around because yeah. he's, you know, different. And he's kind of like, but I'm hungry. Yeah, you cannot come in. I'm hungry. And then this one works really well, too. The six. <laughs> Look, he's like, all right, I'm done with this. I'm, I'm moving on. I'm, I already got hit. And Dang, don't want really, no that, more. That's, that's a squabble. Yeah, isn't yeah. That? <laughs> that, that was a... That's a 5 a plan. That is not a game. This one works really well. Eight of Swords. You know. Oh, yeah. How am I going to get out of this? There's oh, that coming. Oh, this is one of the cards that I don't like. Yeah, that one looks really good, too. Wait, is he dead? No, he's not dead. <laughs> the uh, Nine of Swords. You know, he's having these nightmares. I don't really like it, though. I'm, I mean, it works, but... I just don't like thinking about them having dreams. <laughs> <laughs> that just seems weird. And then the Ten of Sky really works. I mean, that really works. Oh, yeah. I feel sad for that kitty cat. He's gotten, gotten eaten up pretty bad. Looks like somebody's hurt his eye and his leg and or his tail. He just... Mm -hmm. yeah. Get me to the sky! No, I don't need this. Flying! Oh, look at this. How are you guys doing? Yeah, I can pull my yeah. out for the, um, <laughs> the Knight of Swords. He's yeah. getting it. Yeah, that's that works really well. I want to I won't get me dinner. No, it's mine. And then Sky Queen. Queen of Swords. That works. I guess they put him in the air for a reason. And I always think nope. of the sword suit as the winter suit. Yeah. So that works. And then the king of swords. Thank you. That works. I'm calculating. And he's even got his little No, that's refillable. You get some gazebo. Mm -hmm. And it's my little house. Oh look, the two of pentacles. Balancing act. Ah. I like that one. I, oh, I like the beetle. Mm -hmm. I, and I like that it's it's a pretty card too. I like the color balance of it. Um, the five of pentacles. Yeah. Out in the cold. We'll go with that story. I like that there's no church involved. You know, like, I don't like the implications of that. And then, oh, look at this one. It's like they're having a party in there, and I'm not. The Seven of Pentacles. Mm. Yeah, it's kind of neat, isn't it? I would turn that into like a little fairy area. If it was in my, if it was in my yeah. backyard, I'd be like, this yeah. is the fairy area, get away. <laughs> Wait, look at this. The Nine. That's pretty. Oh, yeah. You can look through any of those you want, Shay. I want to look at the... I'm, I'm I'm already sorry. doing my walkthrough with them here, so it doesn't matter. This is kind of interesting. The Ten of Pentacles. Oh my God! I'm cheating. I'm seeing the next <laughs> card. That's cute. I like the different setup, and then they're all kind of a family. You don't? Is there an elderly one there? I guess the one. In, well, no, not the one in the box because. of I don't know. The, they it's all look not about the same. same age, yeah. yeah. I kind of like it when there's an older person in there. I love that. I love hedgehogs. Not to the What's point where I collect them and read? put them on my shelves, but I do love it when I'm surprised and see a hedgehog. Hedgehog. I like that. If they did not, like, <clears throat> I always wanted a hedgehog. Like, I wanted one as a pet. Right. But then I found out how easily they get mites, and that was just. No. Yeah. And they're not very friendly either. What's the cost of your reading for a charge? Um well he charges. I I don't do uh readings that often for other people. I do one for you for free if you want. 
what, what, what else, what else? How does it work? Well, um, multiple cards you lay out mm -hmm. with them over? Yeah, what, what we normally do is um, we, we have a question in mind, um, if you have one. Uh, and sometimes we do just a general reading that just gives you information that you know that you need to know and then we lay out in a certain spread each reader is different how they do it and then um, then we look at the cards and then the cards have some base meaning and then uh, we all three read intuitively which means that we read what the cards are actually telling us versus just what they normally mean as well so is it like a good luck bad luck thing no, no. No. Just no. information that you might even know. Mm -hmm. Here's the story Earth Queen. With the and the Earth King. Oh, no. No. That's the one that's on the book. I no. That's very good. I like the... I think she did a... Or he... She did a really good job painting these. Mm -hmm. Alright. Do your end thing. Oh, my end thing? Yeah, whatever it is you did at the end. And then I'll talk to you in just a second. Just so he doesn't have to cut as much out. Oh no, that's fine. Look at all the paw prints and all the, the stones. Wait, like every you, one of the stones are paw prints. Oh. Of this is a new like back. Uh, that's significant, uh, right? I mean, these are the uh, the, the cats that came uh, before uh, him. Yeah. You know. Uh, Ooh, I like that. Because that seems like an earth thing. Up. Yeah. Because you know in the Lord of the Rings where they. Um, and they're really fun. And I guess it would be the twin stuff. towers where they he buries and his son and he's like, like he's going to where my like forefathers like, you know and they right. all bury him in the same spot that kind of speaks to that kind of thing nice. that's kind of neat this yeah, deck is a deck deck lot deeper sure. than I thought it was going to be actually and I'm they're interested to see what the book says you know because it, it's going to be some of these things are I think significant that I don't understand what they are like the flowers and things Right. I hope they did put that in the book if not I can find out the significance well, you know, sometimes that just comes through too in the reading, so it doesn't really matter, right? Yeah. We just so. tell you what you need to know. But anyway, so this was the, what is it, Mystical Cat Tarot. The Mystical Cat Tarot. So if you all use it, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let us know how it works for you, or if it doesn't work for you, or what. Um, otherwise, we will see you all in the next video, and many blessings. Bye. Bye.